guys, DS Cuber here. Today I'm bringing you an unboxing of the Scube Extreme. So, a few days ago, I was at Barnes & Noble, and as most people in the puzzling community already know, Barnes & Noble is known for selling uh, various uh, twisty puzzles, most of which are generally Rubik's brand cubes, but uh, lately they've had a few Mephrits puzzles in stock, including the Gear Ball and uh, Pyraminx. So, I was in Barnes & Noble a few days ago, and they were selling this Cube Extreme, so I'm like, you know what, I'm going to pick it up because... Why not? It uh, It is a shape mod of a regular Scube, and it looks pretty challenging, so, uh, you know, shape mods are always cool, so I figured, you know what, might as well just give it a shot. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to get right into the uh, unboxing for it. And here is the Scube Extreme. Alright, so here it is, the Scube Extreme. Uh, for some of these stickers, they're actually like really, really high quality, and this puzzle is not, not bad at all. Uh, some of them actually feel kind of textured, like this blue side. Uh, it does have like a kind of scratchy feel. Uh, now that I look at it a little more closely, uh, the rest of the sides do, but these stickers are very high quality, and I can already tell this is going to be a very nice, nice quality puzzle. So let's do some first turns. Alright, not bad, not bad. This is very, very smooth turning. Uh, I do like it. Uh, let's see how it corner cuts. Alright, so it, it does corner cut a little bit. Uh, I would, would not expect it to corner cut much, if at all, because, you know, it is just a shape mod. So, uh, I wonder... If I can take any of these pieces out. Alright, I'm, I'm trying right now to get some of these pieces out, but uh, they do appear to be in there pretty well, so I don't want to like break it. So uh, this puzzle wasn't uh, too expensive. It was $20 from Barnes & Noble. Um, and as a matter of fact, I was looking on the Barnes & Noble website. And uh, they do sell a bunch of puzzles online. And they have a pretty decent selection of Calvin puzzles, uh, most notably the 3x3x5, uh, as well as the cross cube. I have the X cube, which uh, I unboxed in a previous video, but um, they have the cross cube, which is basically a 3 by th is basically a 3x3 um, a three three with an extra side like an extra layer on every side. So if this was the uh, the 3x3, three three, there'd be an extra side here and an extra side here to make it a 3x3x5. Three three then there's an extra side here and an extra side here to make it the X cube. Then there's one on the front and one on the back to make it a cross. So um, they do sell that online as well as a 3x3x5 three three and a Calvin square one. So I was thinking of maybe one day somewhere down the road uh, buying one of those because uh, I do hear a lot of good things about Calvin puzzles. They don't have any speed cubes or anything. They just have some efforts, Calvin puzzles, and uh, uh, Rubik's Brand puzzles. But nonetheless, um, I am really excited about this Mefferts, uh Scube Extreme, I believe it's called. So, um... I will definitely try learning how to solve this. It shouldn't be too difficult because it is just a skewed shape mod. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for this uh, unboxing. Thank you all for watching. If you guys enjoyed this unboxing, be sure to drop a like on this video. If you have any suggestions for future videos, such as puzzles you want me to buy or videos you want me to make, then be sure to drop a comment below because you may be responsible for the next video that I make. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.